If you or a patient or client suffer from bilateral hand and arm pain, then using a muscle angel hands-free is one of the most effective ways to get deep tissue relief without having to rely on one hand to massage the other. It's important to begin by warming up the muscles first. In this case, Christy is rolling back and forth across the nubbin fingers. If you want increased intensity, all you have to do is use your forearm to lean into the muscle angel, letting the weight of your body do all the work for you. Make sure you're not using your hand or wrist to do the pressing. Instead, let the weight of your body lean into the sculpted nub tip or the nubbin fingers. Another effective way to get relief is to place the muscle angel between your two forearms. Roll back and forth and get a double massage without putting pressure on your wrists or hands. This technique is particularly effective while sitting in a big armchair or even while sitting in a wheelchair. All you have to do is lean your body weight into the muscle angel for deep tissue relief. Warming up the muscles in a chair is easy. You can place the muscle angel with the nubbin fingers facing out and lean your forearm into the muscle angel which is against the inside of the chair. Let your body weight do the work for you. In this position, you can actually roll back and forth or you can use the press, hold, and release technique. You can use these same methods by using the sculpted nub tip and going deep into the belly of the knotted areas. The most important thing to remember is that muscle angels are extremely versatile. While we don't have time to go into all the different ways you can use a muscle angel, you can use many of the same techniques whether you're sitting down on the ground, sitting in a chair or wheelchair, leaning against a wall, or even leaning against a table as we showed you earlier in this video. You can get rid of tight trigger points by cradling the muscle angel in your inactive hand and using the press, hold, and release technique. This concludes this portion of the video. We'll look forward to seeing you later.